experience. I've never seen it on my freaking life. Whoa. What was that? That was noise from in there. That was in there, right? I'm here with my friend. Death is not the end. <gasps> Death is not no. the end. No! Oh. Oh. I've never heard it say Three that. lights. Three lights! Three lights! Whoa! Do you want me to try to find Mamera? Oh! Thank you! Thank you so much! Yes. Well, yes, it's not like Yes. I don't know if it's this is part two, part one, or but you probably saw the beginning of the video. It's not going like we thought. <laughs> They're playing us. Literally. Yeah. Okay. They're playing us. So I'm gonna go around, I'm gonna try to go in the dorms because it it would be normally uh, lights out. So it would be curfew, so we're gonna go in the dorm, see if we have activity in the dorms. So, right, see right. you guys. Okay, so I guess we'll head down. Yep, this way. This way. So, right. so we're continuing, we're continuing off, guys. We have to carry on because they're, they're playing us and we don't, if we let them play us, we're, they're winning, and we don't want them to. I'm telling you, man, we're hearing that stuff, so... <sighs> there's anyone in this hallway, or anyone that we heard, please come out again. We heard you. Should be in bed by now. Oh yeah, the staff would be the last, the last rounds. one up. Maybe doing rounds. Yeah. Seeing if any of the mm -hmm. the residents are up. <sighs> All right. Well, if you're down here with us, listening to us right now, we're gonna make our way to the dormitories. So if you want to follow us there, you're more than welcome to. How are you feeling, Chels? I'm getting pretty drained. Yeah. Uh, but I'm, I'm excited to say I've got like dows and stuff, and I have a couple things I want to do in the dorms to hopefully get some answers, but I feel like a lot of our answers are going to be from the kids. Right. Well, the dowsing rods are in the, in the car. Oh. We can go out and get them and do it in a different area. Oh. I, I didn't know you Do you have your pendulum with you? Pendulum? It's in the car? I think so. Yeah, it's in the bag. Okay. I'll take it out. So. Man, this is creepy. <laughs> the whole property is just eerie. It's good, good. Yeah. Oh, this is I don't know if you guys can see, but it's foggy like it was when Lomar and me went to York's Redoubt. Yeah. It was foggy. This is worse. I think so, it's yeah. Worse. That's this way. Yet? No, I've never been to the dorms. You've never been to the dorms? No. Wow, okay. Right. There's a 
a dorm where we had one of the doors closed. I thought it was at the in the cells. We did at the prison. Uh, yeah, another door. We we heard it. Uh, we heard it closed. In this yeah. One. So this one here, there's something going on in every single one of these buildings. Actually, I don't know what it is, but it's that secret too. Yeah. I had yeah. I had that word too. Secret. Yeah. Yeah, there's a secret here. Sure. In the dorms that we're heading to are. Considered like the highest. Cool. That's an animal. Yeah, it's an animal. Alright. Carry on there, animal. Hello, boys. There we go. Ocean South. Coming in. Light right there, you have a ball, and there's a green light right there. You guys don't have to be in bed tonight. You can come out and play, hang out. Can you use the flashlight to go and read? Can somebody come and turn off the flashlight, please? Just turn it and close it, please. And yes, my name is Jeff, by the way. You're one of the boys that stayed here. Please turn that off. Right off, okay? We just want to talk to you. My name is Lamar. My name is Jeff. And I'm Charles. Can you turn it off, please? I'm asking... Lights. 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 <laughs> Do you like the lights? And lights. Mm -hmm. The light, yeah. If you like that flashlight, can you turn it off, please? Please. I'm asking very nicely. It's, it's like that, it's like, even if you we're nice. It, it's because they don't know us, they don't trust us. They're so used to going through so many adults in their lifetime here, right? Mm. Yeah, burning out. I actually used to work in a place like this. Different. And I used to work with boys your age. So I understand that it's hard not having a consistency and having so many different staff just coming in and out of your life and expecting you to trust them right away. So I, I get it, I get the resilience that you have towards us. But just know that we are good people and we're just here to hang out and, and talk. I did bad stuff in my life. I did. I, I didn't end it up uh, uh, like you in, in a place like here. It's not what I'm saying, it's just like, we've been kids too. We understood that, we understand that. Tranquility. <sighs> so you want to be, you, have, you want your tranquility. Is that it? Can you turn off the flashlight if you want to be left alone?
Just twist it or take all your energy out of it. I have kids. I have two kids at home. I have a son and I have a daughter. I understand that when you were here, it was, it was different times. It, families weren't the same. And I'm pretty sure if it would, we would go back, probably your parents would do differently. Does it mean that you don't like Trisha. 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 Are you an old worker here? Are you part of the grounds or something? Or do you have a message for Patricia? If you have a message for Patricia, we can try and find her and Get that message. Your pages? There's four of them. Four boys. One of them is, I keep getting like 16. And I just keep getting an image of them listening to us and talking among each other but they don't trust us one bit <clears throat> like they're listening but it's like there's that wall <clears throat> yeah no, I get that. approach do you want us to try a different approach Is, would you prefer to talk to like one of us? We're on your turf right now, so we can play by your rules. Is there a specific one of us that you would like to chat with? You can start with me. If you want me to go alone somewhere, I'll go alone. Just touch this flashlight. Turn off the flashlight. I'll be more than, than willing to volunteer my time for you, okay? It's gonna scare the crap out of me, but I'll do it if it means you'll talk. Or touch any of the devices, or just say so, okay? trying to see yeah that that's that was my feeling yeah when i had nothing it's like we're sizing you up they're seeing what they can get away with like last time i was alone it was he's alone let's screw it mm -hmm. there's three of us <laughs> That I was literally, the words that were just about to come out of my mouth was that there's three of us. Yeah. Literally just about to say it before I said it. it, it you, 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 you just, the phrase, you, you know the phrase you were going to. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. I know and there's three of us, okay? Chelsea used to work with guys and kids, troubled kids. Let, let's, let's talk with real words. You were trouble kids and you didn't need to be punished. You need to be loved and understood. You like to do laundry. 
We heard that from some of the staff and owners that, you know, own this place. You want to come talk to us in the laundry room? Kind of sounds bad, but like, you know, <laughs> I didn't mean it like that. I just meant, you know. Come and chat. Yeah, that's where you feel comfortable. Down this way. And if you're that black entity that is known to appear here, I just want to let you know you're scaring the owners now. The owner said you you attacked him. I hate to say it, but why don't you come and attack us? If you're that dark entity, if you're the boys, keep your distance. up in this entity. I don't know if I want to. Uh, you should remove the headset. Whoa, trippy. Oh, Good? Cool. Yep. So guys, we're trying, it's called the Delco Experience, and Chelsea is... I'm in. She's in, so there you go. Uh. Doreen. Doreen, I had that name earlier on, Doreen. A little Doreen. Were you a staff, Doreen? Or were you uh, a teacher? What was your function here? My name is Jeff. I'm a veteran. Can you tell me what you, what, where's your function here? Hi. Hi. Can you tell me your name, please? I had Doreen coming in. Is it still Doreen? Yes. yes. So Doreen, were you staff? What was your function here? Yes. You were staff. Were you a teacher? In the dorm. In the dorm. So you were staff that worked in the dorm. Is that it? Overnights. So you work overnights in the dorm. So you were a guard. Mom? You were looking for your mom? Or oh, is Doreen your mom? I'm good. I'm, I'm, I'm hot, but I'm good. How are you? First. It's not my first time. So. So what? It's not my first time, it's my second time. Do you remember me from my first time that I was here? I see red. Yes, my friend Chelsea has a device on her head and 
She can't see a red light. Two of you. Yes, there's two of me. There's my friend Chelsea with the headset. And my name is Jeff. I think you know it. You already said my name. Girl. Yes. It's the girl. It's my friend Chelsea that has the headset. Young. Who is young? You? Or are you talking about us? Yes, you can speak through my friend Chelsea. I hear you. Yes. Do you have a message to pass? Just tell it to my friend Chelsea. Shh. Okay. He's here. Who's here? A man. Which man? Do we have a name? What's his name? It's me. It's you. What's your name? Can you tell me your name? Do you have a name? He holds you back. Are you the entity that is kind of playing with me? That is taunting me? Are you going eyes? Going eyes, yes. There's lights. In the headset of my friend Chelsea. There's glowing eyes. Long nails. Yes. Chelsea has long nails. But you didn't you didn't tell me your name yet. Be careful. Yes, I'm gonna be careful, don't worry. I'm just gonna trust him. Who? Who you don't trust? Me? Which man? In the corner. Which corner? Which corner? Can you tell the me? Left. The left? My left? Okay. Let me check. Behind her. Behind her. So you're in the corner here. Can you tell my friend Chelsea your name, please? I want to know your name. Near the shelf. Near the shelf? Shelf here on my left? Can you knock on that shelf, please? Run. No. I won't run. If you want me to run, close the door. Knock hard. Do something to make us... I have to go. Well, go and leave the place to somebody else. Who? Me? No. Who doesn't like you? Do you have a name? The corner. Yeah, you told me in the corner. The left corner. I checked, but you're not there. 
and I have a mosquito. It won't hurt, I know. They're mosquitoes, but they're annoying. It hurts you uh, in the afterlife? Is it the bad spirit I was summoned here? Isabel. Yes, it's the, the name of my wife. Did you know somebody that was named Isabel? Do you have a message for uh, Isabel? Be careful. Yeah, I know. You told us to be careful. We have to be careful about what? Hmm? What do we have to be careful about? We shouldn't be here. We know, but we have the authorization to be here. And we want to be here because we want to talk to you. I'm old. Well, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I cannot do nothing about that. I'm getting old too. We're all are, unfortunately. But, I will pull my friend Chelsea out in a couple of minutes, but can you please tell me your, your real name? I had Doreen, but I know I'm not speaking to Doreen. I want to know to whom I'm speaking with. Franklin. Hello, Franklin. Thank you for telling me your name. Franklin, why are you tormenting those kids? Why are you hurting the kids? Oh, this wasn't... It wasn't? This wasn't filming. No way. That's all right. Hello. Hello. Are you saying hello to my friend Lomar that just joined us? Just about to pull her out. Who entered the room? Oh. Oh, 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 oh! It's my friend Lomar. He's. Hello. Don't yell. Hello? Were you just with me? Were you the little boy? Are you the little boy that was with my friend? Pull it around. Goodbye. Oh! That scared me. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and you said goodbye just when I was about to touch you. Oh, wow. <laughs> I, I'm going in. I'm, I'm trying to. Oh, you're here. When did you get here? Just now. Just now? And when we said, who is this? He just arrived. Seriously? Yep. Oh my gosh. Is there anyone with us right now? How are you? Tell us who we're talking to. 
Hello? All right. Touch. Did you just touch Jeff? Who touched Jeff? What is Jeff sitting beside? I'm gonna try the stars. Heart coming. Or I'm coming or art coming, something like that. Where are you coming from? Where are you right now? I remember. Heart take. Don't let me. Don't touch me, please. Who's touching Jeff? Tell us your name. If you're going to touch him, at least tell us who you are.
My friend. Baby? Are you a baby? Can you imagine? Imagine what? What happened to you here? Pulling over. You will see. He's gone. Who's gone? Is the man gone? It said something, but I don't it didn't understand it. That was weird. It's like a lady was talking but was muffled. Lady? Me? I'm a lady. Do you want to talk to me? Were there ever girls here? Who lived here? Loving you. Again, that lady that, that it's like she's talking with a hand on her mouth. It's me.
I didn't need. Number one. Yeah. Like, like poking you, pinching you, what were they it, doing? Like grabbing my arm. What the heck? And at one point I literally asked, I was like, are you touching, like, who's touching Jeff? And you were like, it's me. Oh. It, at first I thought it was like a bug. It, it felt like a hand. That's why I was always yeah. brushing. It, I was like, come on, let me, don't touch me. Uh, I was walking in this hallway and I called for Omar like three times and he never responded. So I don't think it was him who was the walking I heard. Whoa. Some of the answers were like pretty accurate though. You kept mentioning this lady who like felt like she was muffled. Yeah. And then I asked, I said, who's holding the lady back? And again, it was like me. But they wouldn't, they wouldn't say their name. I'm pretty sure there's something dark that was summoned here by kids. Mm -hmm. Well, Since Michaela, the other owner, said that there was times that she came in here and like, it looked like rituals had happened. I'm pretty sure since we came, can, kids came and yeah. did stuff because the activity and the energy is not the same mm -hmm. that true. when I came. Because it's like something is keeping yeah. the spirits of talking. So, yeah. Yeah. Omar? Go and look for him. Omar? Hello? You would have a light on because both of our night visions are dead. Omar! Bro! Is he? No. Maybe the prison? Oh, probably. I know how my camera, my night vision camera there with the uh, EDI. Okay. Omar! Could I have been to, to the school? Or the gym. My, my uh, Esther session. You got touched. Mm -hmm. I, I kept like brushing. I thought at first it was a bug, but I felt like hand, uh, uh, fingers touching me. Really? Yep. Jeez. So what are you doing here? Seeing if I could talk to someone in a secluded area. I'm just so wanting to know what this entity is. 
is I think Charles and I we came to a conclusion. Wait, you came to a conclusion? Yeah. I think that after we came here, I'm gonna go sit with you. I'm pretty sure that after we came here, some kids came and summoned something dark. And that dark thing is keeping the others from talking. What's making you say that? Because the energy is not the same. When I came, communication was good. When you came, communication were good. It's like something is keeping them from talking to us. Yeah, it's a different feeling tonight. Mm -hmm. <sighs> That's why I, I, I'm telling you that there's something that was summoned here that wasn't there when we came before and he's keeping all the others like you don't talk because we, we're getting stuff but have you noticed each time we're getting stuff it stopped yeah it's 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 powerful it, like uh, the Okay. I thought I saw it flashing. Oh, it's on the side right there. It's a the red light. Yeah. Uh, like, from what I've been hearing and from what I've been seeing tonight, even with you, like the energy is so much more powerful than like it, it's on, on a different level. Where like I don't even think I needed to use equipment tonight. I was seeing stuff. I was hearing stuff. And it was not water drops. This was movement. This was something moving around the building to different areas. Just the bangs of those shivers. The, the bangs of the drums in the gymnasium. Where I'm at my car and we heard those bangs. I went in the gymnasium, sorry, and I felt uneasy. But like I'm I'm telling you, I'm I'm positive that there's something here that is keeping the others from talking. I, I'm, I'm s certain I got, I got my flashlight right here. Uh, I'm mind boggled right now. Take, take the energy that you have left, okay? I'm gonna put the flashlight right here in between my friend and I. And you're gonna use it to talk to us. Okay? Because it's like the only thing that you've been using tonight that made a certain sense. There you go. Turn it off now. Thank you. Okay. If there's a dark entity that was summoned here and then he's keeping the others from talking. Turn on the flashlight. I'm asking you politely, if there's an entity here that is keeping the others from talking, turn on the flashlight. your energy into it.
All the way. Come on. All the way. If you're the little boy, turn that on. Off. Thank you. Is it off or on? My ears. Oh, it's on. Yeah. No, it's off. Can you turn it back on, please? Or play with that green light here. So if you we are right that something was summoned here and is keeping all of you from talking to us, can you turn off the flashlight? Or no even if you don't want to talk to us, turn off the flashlight. said if you don't want to talk, turn off the flashlight. Just to confirm that you don't want to talk to us, can you turn it back on the flashlight please? Devices, it's not, it's like no, don't touch them. Well, sometimes, sometimes the equipment doesn't work. That's, I've been chasing shit all night. I've, this, this, that's what I'm saying. This time is different. It's more audible, more visual. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you get that. Mm. I wish equipment could give us more, but this has happened so many times. Guys, we're mind boggled. Uh, I was recording the whole time. No! Well, let's review it. You had the breath right there. Mm -hmm. What? Yes. You had the breath light, I, I, like I like at the citadel. I heard something on the previous recording. Right there.
Thank you, sir. Yeah, that was distant. Oh, you know what? Oh. There's another one. Right there. Yeah. yeah. You got a couple of breath in there, buddy. <sighs> yeah. That was a growl. Can you back it up? It's going to start the whole thing. Alright, oh, that was us. But we'll check this out at the. Uh, Oh, Del. Yeah, yeah. Okay, do you have an SD card in there? I don't know, but I do have an earphone slot. Do you have a, a, a place you can connect it to a computer? I think if I have an aux, I might be able to. I don't have an aux cable, like a circle to the circle. I have one. You have one? 2.5 millimeters, yeah. I'm pretty sure if we connect that to a computer, Something will pop up and we can listen to it. We'll do it at the hotel. It has no, um, it has no SD card button. But if the, it will, USB, 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 actually. Oh. Okay, I'll think that'll work. Yep. Uh -huh. uh, let's go on. Let me check if I'm still recording. Yes. All right. Oh. I think we got it. We should go get the rest of the stuff over there. And, and yeah. Call it a night. I might do my uh, outro in the morning. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Well, Randy said he might, like, it might be tomorrow morning and then he'll be back. So maybe we can. Well, what we can do is when we're done packed uh, up at the motel in the morning, we can swing by here quick. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So. Uh, Wrap up tomorrow, guys. Morning, Ghost Riders and Heartless Angels. Yeah, it's the day after the investigation. A crazy night. Crazy night. We're having activity and everything was like dying down on the spot. Like, like a dark entity was summoned there. And from now on, he's keeping the others from talking. It, it, we heard movement uh walking and talking during the day and come there at night we had hits on our stuff but uh, it was it too it, the energy was weird it was getting us to chase it yeah you know like i was hearing stuff we were running all over the place you were trying your place it didn't want to, it just wanted to play games. Yeah. It just wanted to play games. Like, try to catch me and um, catch me if you can. Kind exactly. Of, you know. Exactly. Like, so. it, was, it was almost annoying at first. Like, you can't, you can't, 
The paranormal's weird like that. You can't just... just it's gonna happen. Mm. It's, you're gonna have nights like this. The issue is, it, this place, there's something in there that's a secret. That they, mm. And they just do not want to tell yep. anyone. Anyway. And we have the word secret coming in. I had it on my spirit talker. I think Lomar had it on his spirit talker. Yeah, I think I did. And it's something shrouded in mystery and I think it's going to be a part three, I think. Yeah. And yeah. So you guys, I hope you enjoyed it. And if you're not subscribed, well, welcome. And I hope you've enjoyed it. And just hit that subscribe button and don't forget that notif notification bell. <laughs> that was weird that notification bell so you get notified every time i get a video out so until then guys i'll catch you on the next paranormal adventure Hello. peace out.